All right, it's a supersized bus. The Harris County Precinct One Constable's Office is showing the $1 million worth of counterfeit merchandise seized during the Super Bowl. Channel 2's Phil Archer is live tonight. And Phil, this includes fake Super Bowl tickets. Fake tickets and just about everything else you could think of, things like this T-shirt. This is one of 20 to 30,000 counterfeit Super Bowl pieces of merchandise that were seized here while the Super Bowl was in Houston. Teams of police from Constable's Precinct 1, from Homeland Security, and from Houston Police fanned out across the city beginning Thursday and in a four-day period confiscated something estimated, something on the order of about a million dollars in pirated Super Bowl merchandise. They also made 17 arrests, most of those for counterfeiting. That's a state jail felony. The sad part about this is that the public has purchased some of these items. And they're inferior. They don't. Uh, they're not as the same quality, and uh, they're really just just garbage. And a lot of the organizations that are making money off of this are actually funding other illicit criminal activities. Uh, we ran into a number of people uh, out there on the streets that were involved in other crimes or had criminal histories in their past, and so you know it makes you wonder a little bit: what are they actually doing with this money? Now, police say profits from sales of fake merchandise often go into other criminal enterprises, and the NFL is moving to get that back as well. Uh, they've filed eight civil lawsuits suing the folks who were selling this stuff, trying to get the cash back that they made off of it. Reporting live downtown, I'm Phil Archer, KPRC Channel 2 News. All right, Phil.